Bonjour à tous et bienvenue à Québec. Mon nom c'est Daniel et je vais être votre guide cet après-midi. Un English message will follow. Nous allons maintenant faire un tour historique et architectural qui va durer environ 1h35 il y a 12 arrêts. Je vais vous décrire ces 12 arrêts pour vous. Good afternoon, welcome to Quebec City. My name is Daniel and I'll be your guide this afternoon for this tour. We're going to be doing a historical and architectural tour. Québec a une population de 530 000 personnes et avec les alentours, c'est environ 700 000, ce qui nous fait la plus grande communauté francophone en Amérique du Nord. On parle de français 95 So Quebec City has a population of 530 000 people with the surroundings and boroughs. It's about 700 000, which makes us the largest French community in North America where we speak French at 95%. The train station is like half a million. 1893, and it went into stages. So uh, it started off with 160 rooms. It wasn't that long. Burned down, a uh, part of it burned down in 1922. They were constructed, and in 1924 they made the center. 
Nous allons, nous sommes maintenant sur le boulevard Champlain. Si vous suivez ce boulevard jusqu'au bout, vous arrivez aux deux ponts de Québec et la Pointe. Ce sont les deux derniers ponts pour traverser le fleuve. Korean War, right here on the left. 
We're now going alongside the Western Wall. We're still not inside the fortified city, except the Moulin Jean, the new uh, the west. De la fortification, alors nous ne sommes toujours pas à l'intérieur de la ville fortifiée. Vous allez voir de petites entrées, il y en a une plus grande que l'autre, vous avez vu, il faut que vous There's two small entrances here on the left. One is bigger than the other, do you know why? Somebody's going to say it. Ah, you got it. One was for the horses, the other one for the soldiers. As you can see, we had tiny soldiers. Alors, euh, c'est ici qu'on tient le plus grand carnaval hivernal au monde. Rubber jacket. <rire> on suit en 1906. Bridge. The Quebec Bridge is going to be at the far end right where I'm pointing. It's... Alors, euh, de l'autre côté de la rivière, si vous avez de l'église, ça va être dans les 125 000 personnes. On the other side is the city of Lévy. Fortress. That's why you can't see it. It's 550 varieties of flowers in this garden. There is also a plaque to commemorate our national trim. It's one of the best ones. The events of the war of the Seven Years at that time. It was a very determined battle and very important for the American Army and the Thirteen Colonies. C'était entre le général français Louis-Joseph de Montcalm et le général anglais James Wolfe. Pendant l'été de 1759, plus de 40 000 obus ont été lancés par les Britanniques sur Québec, détruisant beaucoup de la base ville où on se trouvait tout à l'heure. Les deux générales, Wolfe et général Montcalm, sont décédés dans cette bataille, naturée qu'environ 30 minutes de tuant 3 à 400 soldats from the Seven Year War. It was uh, between uh, the uh, French General Louis Joseph de Montcalm and the English General James Wolfe during the summer of 1759. Over 40,000 firebombs and cannonballs were shot on Quebec by the British, destroying a lot of the lower town of where we were earlier. We are now on the Rue Cartier. Très jolie rue avec euh, plusieurs magasins, euh, boutiques et restaurants. Et regardez ces lampadaires, de nice uh, stores, boutiques, restaurants. And look at these uh, street lamps. That's what they are. They're actually street lamps painted by uh, different French Canadian artists. the Church of St. Trinity in Paris, France, as a model to build this church. They also, uh, which also has one of the nicest facades, all the businesses in Boomi, very much. Another nice architectural house on the right. J.A. Boisson. The first Anglican church in Quebec. But it has changed the... Uh, Venues. It's now in front of you that round side that uh, you see is actually the Quebec's capital, the oldest theater in Quebec, uh, which uh, was built in 1903. And Celine Dion did her beginnings when she was a young singer. But here, the Quebec's capital on the left. Nous sommes à l'intérieur de la ville fortifiée. We're now entering the fortified city.
boisson ou chocolat. This is also where the best bakery in Quebec is. And they make the best chocolate croissant ever made. I'm sorry? Where? I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> Too bad. No, it's right here on the right. So just see. Vous pouvez droit. Alors, euh, juste pour vous rappeler que sur vos bracelets, vous avez le nom Portofino qui vous offre 15% de radet. Si vous décidez d'aller manger là. Just a reminder that on your bracelets you have the Portofino restaurant which offers you 15% discount if you decide. Le meilleur. Ça va bien. Portofino, on a l'air de le Portofino qui vous dégouche. Nous longeons euh, ce qu'on appelle. Euh, Shortly on the right hand side, once we pass the cannonball embedded in the tree. We don't know the true story of that cannonball, but it's going to be at the foot of the tree when I tell you. The people on the, the left hand side of the bus, you might have to get up and see. L'histoire du boulet de canon, on dit qu'on mettait ça au début du 19e siècle autour des maisons pour pas qu'ils se fassent frapper par des calèches pour endommager la maison. The houses in the early 1900s. Uh, to stop the uh, horse and carriages from damaging the houses when they turn the corner, some of them uh, drive like our drivers today and, and would damage a house. Right after this building, uh, just at present it's fist, look at the foot of the tree. We have, we can't stay here long. Just so you know, and if you personnel dans le bus, aussi, euh, les pourboires et les types ne sont pas compris dans le tour, mais ils sont très bien appréciés. Si vous avez aimé votre tour, ils sont partagés avec notre magnifique chauffeur, Jeff Vero. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the end of my tour. I hope you enjoyed it. I had a good time with you folks. Please don't forget any of your personal items in the bus. Also, uh, tips and uh, gratuities are not included in the tour, but they're very well appreciated. And they're shared with our wonderful driver, Jeff Vero. Uh, they hope. So, uh, for the people having have a great stay in the Merci. Au revoir.